Today, I will be showing CSGO tips and tricks used by pro players to win the matches. Let's go! Cynic is going to smoke Moto with a different lineup. You're going to see the Moto smoke he throws is going to actually leave a gap towards the right side of Moto when they wrap towards long here. So G2 players think that Moto's actually smoked off. However, to their surprise, Cynic comes through and is able to frag multiple players. In CS2, the pit one-way smoke will no longer be effective, so you're going to want to use this defensive smoke rather instead, so just go ahead and underhand it towards the left of the wall. If the T's do Molotov you, that's no problem, you could push up behind the cover of your smoke and wait until the Molotov runs out to go back if you want. Shush smokes the corner, standing in front of the barrel, aims there, then jump throw. Just be careful when you use this smoke in that aspect that the CT's can play around it. Zaiwu is in CT, he's going to ask for a boost on top of this bench where he can see all the smoke, spots Nico at triple. Heroic smoke off banana which allows Zaiwu to get inside this cubby which he uses this lineup shown here in order to Molotov new box which is supposed to cover the boost as well as the area behind new box but you see the Molotov was misthrown. That's because he needed to slightly aim a little bit higher and you're going to see me do so then without moving your mouse back in the corner then left click throw. This Molotov covers both areas as you can see. This Molotov will come in handy in CS2 if there are no skyboxes on Inferno. Here's a quick word from my sponsor. Today's video partner is Keydrop, a site that has many cases you can open to win some sweet skins. Special events are always going on that offer a lot of bonuses. I'm going to be opening Poker's case and I got a FAMAS roll cage which I do not want. I will use the upgrade feature where you have a chance to get a better skin. Now if you don't like any of the skins you get, use the skin changer mode to pick out a nicer skin or use contracts to possibly upgrade as well. Keydrop has case battles where you can play against other players. Whoever has the best skins takes it all. Every day you can open a free case to win money. Keydrop offers a lot of different deposit and payment methods. Plus you can withdraw skins instantly. Use code NART and get a free 50 cents and 10% deposit bonus. Link will be down below in the description. Device is gonna hit the fast van jump and it makes it look super easy with this movement. Goes for the opening pick. You're going to see him get the frag here and then he jumps on top of this window and you're going to see it's a very strong position as his flash does not blind him. Modesty gets boosted short and look at what he does. He ducks and he can see that there's a gap inside the top of the brick. Exertion smokes bottom connector and then you're going to see him from alongside this wall. He's going to throw a flash that lands over the ramp which blinds Empires, allows Dexter to push up and catches him out. Despite Empires holding this very tight angle, he gets flashed off the angle and he has to fall back. Rain from next to Ticket is going to throw this combo which will consist of a deep ramp smoke and flash. JDC jump spotting makes contact and is going to fall off and as he does so he throws a smoke towards the bench. Look how good this smoke is as he plays around it as well as it negates two of the T's Molotovs. Vitaly are going to use the B and E mid smoke CT setup where they throw a mid smoke and then boost the player on top to see all the smoke. Shush is ducked next to the trash can. He's going to throw two A smokes for the top and down smokes. Heroic are going to use these smokes as bait as well as cover from A site to go up towards short. Zaiwu is in the post plant boosted, has this lineup for a one way smoke where he has a gap over this wood area to see through towards short and he's able to tag up Kadian. Let me know in the comments below if you like or dislike that one way smokes are mostly gone in CS2. Matches is going to smoke short from outside T apps and they're going to pair this up with a B execute from apartments. They try to pull rotations towards the short player to go back towards B. However, that doesn't work out for them to be able to creep up behind that smoke. Diha throws a smoke off this lower wall. Then he jumps on top of these boxes where he has a one way for the door side. Nico gets run boosted off blue and he actually used this a couple of times during this match and you're going to see the purpose here. You're going to avoid the CT Molotov as well as you're able to get fast into secret or go through the garage smoke. Look at this party Molotov from Fame that's going to cover and spread to a lot of the position. So it covers behind the tree as well as towards the side. This is the Molotov that you guys should be using for the future. 
retake B nades from some Pias. He's gonna smoke off short. Then he is going to Molotov pit by aiming there, left and right click throw. Device is gonna smoke heaven. Instead of getting behind the wall, he positions like this, aims there, runs forward before he reaches the other part of the shadow, jump throw. Previously, I showed Rops from this pillar on B site set up for this flash. However, he never threw it. Here in this round, he's actually gonna throw it here for Kerrigan, which is going to be a right click throw moving forward. Rops throws the perfect A lurk smoke from inside this cubby, inside A main, where he's ducked like this on that part of the ground. Aim here, then stand up, left click throw. He's actually gonna go through the smoke here, gets flashed through from his teammates. But this smoke will leave no gaps on either side. Nico has this set flash from door that he throws from Monsi, who's pushed past the door to peak bridge. Zaiwu mid one way smoke for house. He's going to stand inside the corner, aims right there, then right click throw. Afterwards, he's going to push up where there's a gap in the bottom left of the smoke, which then he uses to delete Hunter. Nico has an A nade set from top of the boat. He's going to duck at this part here. While duck, he's going to aim here for the heaven smoke, then run throw bind. Afterwards, he stands up, aims there, left click throw. This is for the platform Molotov. Top dark smoke from outside dark, you're going to see rain position with this dark mark on the ground, stands up, aims here, then jump throw. This smoke is going to land at the top of the doorway blocking it off, which will allow rain to take free control of dark. OC throws the left fast B site smoke and you're going to see Brokey ping for the boost here to see over the smoke, however he loses the duel against him. You need to know and use this flash from Kerrigan who's towards the B site, towards the CT side. Flashes mid for Twist who was towards the mid door side to peek off of. You saw Twist look away from the flash and then he peeks and he's getting a multi-frag off this. Great flash that you need to use and know. Madden peeks bridge at the start of the round. He gets a frag, throws a flash and re-peeks with the flash while the flash lands behind him. Blinds both the FaZe clan players. Check out this CT setup from Vitality. Apex is mid yellow, has a smoke out, and he's going to smoke a bottom yellow here, and you're going to see him fall back. And then Zaiwu's holding this off angle that won't get flashed from the God Flash. He re smokes yellow. The retake nades come in from Heroic, and he's gonna fall back. Kagan gets boosted inside A main to peek over the box to see if there's a jump spotter towards the sandbag, doesn't see anybody, then from the same position is going to ask for the run boost, which he owns Zaiwu. Zaiwu is holding the off angle, however this round he has an M4 and Kagan is going to beat him to the punch. Heroic are attacking A, Sphinx throws a smoke front sight, gets towards Tetris here, where he's going to jump on top, holds behind the smoke, gets the frag and falls off. Defensive B smoke from Dupree that you need to use. He throws it off double, which the smoke will then bounce back towards default. And then it's going to give you a lot of cover as well as gives you a one way if you jump on top of default, which we see Magis do here. Here is what the defensive smoke would look like from the T side. You can see that it gives a lot of cover for the CTs. Kaden will throw the same smoke, however, from a different position. He's going to throw it off the wall, then tries to jump on top of the fall hover gets flash where Vitaly already wrapped them. Check out this one-way smoke from Hiku, who throws the smoke inside this beam. It's going to give him this one way towards short where he's gonna get the frag onto the player headshot. Make sure to submit your trick in my Discord. Perfect CT pistol setup from Entz on the B site. Entz is going to use this flash thrown from Matt in this back corner. Nerds peeks out the flash and is able to capitalize from it. Every pro team is throwing this HE nade at the start of the round off this mid wall that does really good damage. You're going to see Twist followed up with the Molotov for the box, which prevents any aggression from the CTs to peek towards lane. Fast donut smoke, you're going to get stuck into this corner of these rocks, then you're going to put your crosser at the tip of the building without moving your mouse. Go ahead and run alongside the wall before you hit the corner of this building here, jump throw. Use this smoke for your A rushes and make sure to subscribe as you don't want to miss out on future CS2 tips and tricks videos.